Sorry, uh, how can I help you? We have to put the block to the hackers, okay? We are the certified computer technician, and hacking activities have been going on illegally through your computer. Oh, God. Right. And, and which company are you calling from? I'm calling you from Microsoft. Right. Okay. So can you please tell me what was the last time that you used your computer? What was the purpose? Yeah, I uh, probably about an hour ago or so. I beg your pardon? I used it an hour ago. What for? Just to uh, send some emails. Emails, right? Okay. Yes. Ma'am, what happened ex exactly is when you download this email, when you send an email or browse any of the websites, right? Malicious files uh, that the hackers are sending to your computer are ent entering your system, all right? Which is in instead, which is in return leading to the corruption of your computer, okay? And they're also, the hackers are also having an access to your license ID number through those malicious files, all right? So we have to put a block. We have to put a block. It's going to be like a layer which is going to protect your computer from entering of the hackers, all right? Okay, sorry. Um, you, you're not coming through very clear. Can you just push the microphone away from your mouth a little bit because it's all very distorted? Sorry. Uh, very sorry for that. We have to prevent the hackers, as I said, ma'am. Uh, we are. We will use our software to put a block to the hackers. It's going to act as a layer to prevent the malicious program from entering inside your computer system, okay? Okay. So, so first of all, I need I need to just tell yes. you that I'm not a ma'am. I'm a I'm a Mister. Um, Very sorry for that, Miss. I'm not a Miss either. I'm a Mister. Okay. You keep okay. saying ma'am and... on your computer. I have to put a block to those hackers right now. Okay, so, and what is your name? My name is uh, Nancy, as I already told you. Nancy, I didn't hear you because it, you're coming through a bit distorted. Okay, right. so so what did you he's want me to do? He's a technician, ma'am. He's on the line, okay? Okay, then. Hello? Hello? Yes. Uh, thanks for being a hold. This call is a transfer to me. My name is Jason. How are you doing today? Jason, did we did we speak yesterday? Uh, yes. Yes. Okay, so... Okay, all right. So, okay, so are you in front of your computer now? Yeah, I'm in front of my computer. All right, wonderful. So now, what do you exactly see on your computer screen? So, so um, can I ask you a couple of questions, Jason? Yes, please. Yeah, so if, if we spoke yesterday, then mm -hmm. haven't we already solved this problem? Yes, but today we need to recheck it each and everything. You need to check you know, it? The problem will be not resolved. Maybe possible you're going to receive a call because uh, as we already told you that the problem is a very critical and we need to communicate with the customer each and every day to see the problems, all right? You're right. Every day you need to call me? Not every day. Till now, the problem is not going to get it resolved. So, what? Well, how do you know that the problem's not been resolved? Yes, we need to recheck it each and everything. That whatever the application and the software we have provided, everything is working fine. And is this? Are you going to do this again via any desk? Uh, exactly. But today we will not take a more time. Hardly, it's a five to ten minutes, not more than that. Right, okay, because I've already installed any desk and yes, you've, you've you already have installed and on your computer screen, can you see there is a one diamond symbol is there of the any desk, right? Yes. Yes, open that box. Right, and then what's going to happen? And then after that, you can see over there, there is a number is there, right? Yes. Yeah, tell me that number. So the number is uh, 1626 uh -huh. 0428. Okay. No, it's not matching. 1626 0428. That's correct. No, it is not matching. It's showing the address you have entered is invalid. Oh, okay. So I must have. Uh I must be giving you the wrong number. I must be reading the wrong thing. You do one thing. Once again, press the windows and the letter R together at the same time. 
Say again, sorry. You, uh, you cut out then. Uh, have, a, have a look on the keyboard. Can you see there is a control button on the extreme left bottom corner side of a keyboard? Yes, I can see that. Um, yes. You still there, Jason? Have you gone? I can't hear you anymore. I'm any... still with you. Uh, I'm still with you. Can you hear me? Yeah, you're very, very faint. You've like gone very in the background. Now can you see the next to the control button? Which button you can see? Uh, the Alt key. Alt key. All right. And may I know that which web browser you're using? A Safari, right? That's correct. Yes. Y yes. Can you please pull up your Safari. So, Jason, I can hardly hear you. You've gone very, very faint again. It's it's a better line now. It's yeah. a better line now. Yeah, that's better. That's better. Uh, okay, all right. Now, please pull up your Safari browser. Yes, I've got it open. You've got it open. Type on the Safari www. Yes. Anydesk.com. Right. Well, I've already got anydesk.com, so... I, but it is a, maybe possible it is a going to crash down. So once again, we will do it. Not an issue. You type www.anydesk.com. Okay, so before I do all this, right, just explain mm -hmm. to me, just very carefully, just explain to me, because you need to give me some comfort what you're doing here. Just explain mm -hmm. to me what, what's going to happen. When I install this, I give you the number then does that mean you're going to log into my computer? Uh, no, I'm not going to log in in your computer. Just we will transfer the one virus detector that is going to detect once again that everything is fine. That's only we need to do and nothing else. You only having a control, everything, you're only going to do it. Yeah, but you know, on the website it says connect to computer remotely, be it from the other end or halfway. We will, we will connect your computer screen so through the help of that, we can able to transfer the security in your computer. Yeah, but if so, you know that I know you're from Microsoft and all that because that what that's what you've told me. Um, mm -hmm. But you know there are a lot of stories in the press at the moment about illegal people that are hacking, getting into your computer exactly through the way that you're explaining it to me. I'm totally understanding your concern. You are absolutely correct from your point of view. And I really appreciate that whatever the things you're going to do, you are going to double cross check it each and everything. Yes. Because you know that. Yes. Each and every day, each and every day, we are only going to receive in thousands of calls that someone is given a call from Microsoft and uh, uh, this happened, that happened, then after that my computer is not working, whatever it is. Yeah, absolutely. And not only and that, people... Uh, I've heard stories, and, and, and you're working for Microsoft, maybe you've heard the same stories, that mm. using this software, the AnyDesk software, because I've heard that mentioned, they, mm. they're putting a file on their computer, right? Mm -hmm. And then they won't remove the file unless I pay or somebody pays money mm. to these hackers uh, before they will release the computer. And this goes on for weeks and weeks and weeks. First, and of all, first of all, I would like to tell you that here we are not looking for the, any money or anything like that. Really? Here we, yes, we are not going to ask you for the, any money and you don't need to pay anything over here. Right, okay. So your service then is completely free? Yes. And you're not going to put any anything on my computer to stop it from working and then you're not going to no. then hassle me or basically fraud me um, because you know this is like fraud isn't it this is illegal what you're doing Jason you do know that uh, what, what I am doing it is not illegal what I'm doing it is a not illegal, not illegal, and uh, I'm hundred percent sure about it. And if you want, I will give you the evidence as so, well as the things which we are going to do. It is a not illegal. I'm not doing any illegal work. Why I'm not doing any illegal work? You will ask me. Tell me the reason. So I'm not asking you for the, any money over here. No. So you, that to resolve the problem, uh, we are looking for the money or we are looking for the anything? Absolutely not. As I already mentioned, you the each and everything. May, may I ask how old you are, Jason? Sorry? May I ask how old you are, Jason? 
Uh, but I'm not so, so sorry. I'm not authorized to give this postal information. Okay, you sound like a young man who has a full life ahead of him, right? And mm -hmm. I'm really concerned that you are doing this type of work. And yes. and because it's it's not, you know, I don't know how you manage to go into a call center uh, where you are forced to do this to. Unsuspecting computer pe owners, usually probably older people. Uh, they uh, don't. First of all, first of all, first of all, please, 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 please stop. Listen to me, okay? Yes, I'm listening. Uh, yes, first of all, I would like to tell you the one thing. You're not supposed to tell me that what I am doing it is what I am not doing. You're not supposed to tell me that. Because no. According to me, what is correct, I am doing. Okay. You're doing what? According to me, what is correct? According to me, what is correct? I'm doing either I'm working in a call center or I'm working in anywhere. I'm going to doing for my own. Okay. From tomorrow, if I'm going to sit in the home, are you going to pay me the money? No, but the thing is, you there are other jobs. No, 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 no. no. Come to the point. If you said no, all right, then you're not supposed to tell me about my any job profile. Well, if it's something illegal that you're doing, I absolutely am in my right to tell you that you shouldn't be doing it. No, we are not going to do any illegal thing. Of course you are. Of course you are. I, do you think that... How you can say it? How you can say it? Can you able to prove it? Jason, how do you... Do you think I'm completely stupid? Ma'am, can I tell you the one thing in a very polite way? If you can listen to me. I can't, can hardly hear you now. You can listen to me. Can I tell you the one thing in a very polite way? Do tell me in a very polite way. I'm being polite to you too. Yes. You please don't look up for me that uh, uh, where I'm walking and what I'm walking and what I'm doing and what I'm not doing. Okay? Because from the tomorrow, if I don't have a job, then you are not going to be me, right? No, but well, I don't know who you are and where you're working. But if I could give you a legal job, then I would give it to you if I had it. If you're, are you able to provide me a good job? Tell me. Well, the, the, that's not the point, is it? The point is. That is the point. That is the point. That is the point. From, if you are able to give me the, any job, tell me I will, I'm going to quit the job today. And from tomorrow, I'm going to do whatever you want and I will follow that one. Yeah. <laughs> well, for, the thing is, by I, I understand that you need to earn money and therefore you will take any job. But I'm sure there are other jobs available that you can earn money rather than doing this particular job. Okay, all right. Then you only suggest me which another job is available. I will go and do that job. Yeah, I'm not in the country that you are working. I'm in the UK only. You're not in the UK, Jason. <laughs> really? Yes. Well, if you were in the UK, you know, then tell me the full address that you are at and I'll come and see you. I'm, oh. I'm, in, I'm in Reading, Microsoft Campus, Saint Valley Park, Reading. No, you're not in Microsoft, Jason. Don't, don't be dishonest. Just tell the truth. I'm telling you the truth. You are not working. Why are you swearing? Because you are speaking unnecessarily. So please fuck off. The, the, really, there is no need for that language. Uh, please fuck off. There really is no need for that language, Jason. I'm not swearing at you, am I, for what you're trying to do to me? Please, ma'am, please fuck off. So that that's really not appropriate language. And I understand your frustration that I'm not trying to play ball with you. But you guys are ringing us now every day, twice a day. Did you know that? Can you please fuck off? Why are you swearing at me? Can you please fuck off? There really is no need for that kind of language, is there? Can you please fuck off? 
Well, I, I'm happy to stay on the line for as long as possible because hopefully the bill payer will be paying a higher fee for this. Okay, all right, then be with me, okay? Say again. Then be with me. And how old you are? So I, I can't quite understand what you're saying there. How old you are? How old you are? That, well, I'm not going to say, I'm afraid. Then why are you fucking around? I'm not. I'm trying to suggest to you... You are. You are. You are fucking around. <laughs> no. <laughs> Actually, Jason, it's the other way around, isn't it? Because you're you're being forced to do illegal stuff for your employer. You still there? Still there, Jason? What's the plan for the weekend? Oh, very relaxing weekend. What about you? Are you making more calls at the weekend? Uh, no, on the weekend we are off. Tomorrow we are going to not going to do the calls. Tomorrow is a completely off. So obviously, that tomorrow I'm going to enjoy it. Okay, and what what will you be doing then? When your when your day off, what are you going to be doing? Hanging out with friends? That, yes, obviously. Right. Yeah, we'll be hanging out with friends. That's it. And uh, and That's do boyfriend. and do your friends do the same job as you? Do you have a Do you have a boyfriend? No, no, I'm married. You're married. Where is your husband? <laughs> I think I think you're mistaken. I'm a Mister. I'm not a Miss. Oh, you're a mixture? Yes. It sounds like you are a woman. Check it out. Are you a woman or a man? No, I'm definitely a man. Yeah, you always... No, oh, but... No, you are lying. You are lying. You are lying. You are lying. I'm not lying. My name is... Lying. No, I'm not lying. You're lying. I'm not. You are. Well, you should know because that's part of the work that you're doing, which is lying. 